Welcome back to my garage. We're starting on the new dyno build today. Here's the CAD drawing. I might make some changes along the way and I'll explain more about the different features and, and the design along the way as we build it. Just want to give a huge thanks to everybody who's joined my Patreon and, uh, and everybody who's been donating and, uh, and all the support. A huge thanks. If you watched my my previous video, you know that I'm in a week now. I'm starting to work half time, and I'm gonna spend the rest of that, like the other half, out here in the garage. And um, so it it means a lot. And so just thank you, thank you. I need to clear up something from that video. I am going to do some side projects, but fear not. The 50cc single cylinder, world's most powerful two stroke. That's the main focus until it's done or working or failed and then the next world's most powerful two stroke project that's the main focus so fear not That worked out so so. It was really apparent that my uh, my setup was not rigid enough. The last part there actually moved. It'll work. It's not a problem. They don't fit though. <laughs> I'll bring you in closer and show you. But for extra style points, I made this contour with just the tiniest bit of clearance around the case, and uh, the holes don't line up. It's uh, it's bumping into the case and. Uh, and it's really unnecessary to have this little clearance there, it's uh, kind of stupid. It's probably because I know Kai Wheeler when he machined the cases, he did lose some steps and there was some mishaps there. So uh, it's just 
just cosmetic, but it makes this perfect fit not fit. This one is supposed to go on the other side there. Unfortunately, that's all I have time for this week. I I could delay posting this video and put in some more machining and uh, and release it next week. But uh, I think to prove my point, the point of how working half time and half time at my normal job and half time here, how much of a difference that will make, both in the time, the actual time available for this, and also my energy, because. Uh, because working full time with kids around you all day, I work in a kindergarten, it uh, can really, really wear you down. At least it has started wearing me down a lot lately. And uh, I just feel I need to do it less. Do it less to to perform my best both here and at at in the kindergarten. To, I, I like to see myself as, as an inspiration for the kids, as a role model. As like I, see, I like to see my purpose in the kindergarten as an inspiration and a role model and to show them, show them the way, so to speak, and, uh, and teach them how, to, how they, they don't have to be, like become cheaps and uh, just parts of the machine, robots, but something else, something more interesting. I feel that's my purpose there, and uh, I feel I can't fulfill the purpose when, uh, like I've I've been feeling lately that I can't fulfill that purpose because it's too much for me. It's been become too much, and part of that is it is taking away time that I could spend be spending here. Okay, enough. Of, <laughs> the good thing is I've done it. I'm doing it. Fifty percent off. Fifty percent. Fifty. <laughs> Half time, half time normal job, half time here, maybe more. We'll see how this pans out. Just received 20 liters of methanol and nitromethane, 25% nitromethane, 15% oil. I the, the lower oil content stuff was uh, out of stock, and uh, this should work for for testing purposes. Okay, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for much more frequent and longer, better videos. See you next time.